Hello and welcome back to the Man Cave, I'm the UP Gamer. Today we're going to play some more Calibria Crystal Guardians and I am going to be running some Arena. I'm working on my totems, so I'm just going to do a bunch of these. Show you my team, show you their skills, show you their uh, stats, that kind of thing. Uh, we're going to start off, we're just going to rip through these Apex Arenas. And we're not even going to watch them. And already getting my arse whooped. Well, that is not the team that I have been using. And there, let's try this. There we go. And I'll be showing you, you know, these guys and what they do and. Right, a couple more of these. Well, that ain't good. Well, let's try that. Just enough, and one more. Alright, now we're going into a regular arena. You can see I'm ranked 1407. Um, I'll be pushing that higher tomorrow. Um, I just wanted to get some more... Some more stuffs. Alright. Jumping into the regular arena, yes. Not what I wanted. So these are the, this is one of the teams I'm running, and this is just a massive bruiser team. They just soak damage, more damage, 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 and then uh, basically they just have so much life and everything. And the golem is throwing out his shield, druid's healing. Um, that by the end we can we can win. I don't know if I can win this team, but we're gonna check it out. And usually I just auto with this because they just sit there and soak damage, and it just takes a long time. But the win's a win, and I'm just farming points. So, so we're gonna do, we're gonna do that. Try and kill her first. And duel, and uh, with Dragoon, it works really well because he just he can uh, pull, pull the buffs off and stuff. And I'll show you Arthur. I'll show you all these guys. That one hurt, Dragoon. Next we'll go with their Dragoon, I think. I don't know if I can even kill it. We'll see. <laughs> yeah, this could be a losing battle. But it might not. Drew gets a couple heals off. and Their uh, Destruction Idol hits hard. I would love to have one, but as you know, I can't get one. If you've been watching any of my videos. Yeah, I want to thank, say thanks to everybody uh, that keeps coming back to the channel and liking and subscribing. Um, I really appreciate it. Well, there you go. He killed himself on that reflect, which I don't have. So this is going to be a loss, I believe. Maybe we'll switch it to the him. Well, no, we really got no choice. But you can see how much damage this team just soaks. And it's all because of uh, the golems. But that's going to definitely be a loss. Well, there you go. How's that for a start? We'll try this team with the other... Uh, my other team. And I will, like I said, I will go over. All their stats and the skills I'm using and everything like that. And this is going to be tough for me. This is about as high as I get in Arena. So, who knows how many I'm going to win. But I did want to make a video for you guys. So, 
All right, we are going to try and stop his passive. And that's a fail. So no one's going to die, I don't think. Oh, well, we got one. Silence. And there you go. The power of Lich King. Alright, well I'll go and show you what my team is, or what my teams are, and why they work. Alright, so this is Mikhail. He's on speed, defense, defense. Uh, the skills he has. Alright, so this skill is going to silence everyone for one turn. Um, execute final judgment, 200 or 350% attack and damage, 50% chance to silence targets, and after attacking, reduce all allies' skill cooldowns by one turn, excluding this skill. And if none of the skill, none of the allies' skills have a cooldown, restore 30% of their energy. I have it all the way skilled up. So basically what this does, you're going to silence the enemy, you're going to renew your own turns, and if you don't have any turns on cooldown, it's going to give you 30% more energy. So it turn cycles big time. This one, uh, 285 in damage, and after skilling up it's 100%. So it's 100% chance to disable target's passive skills for two turns. After attacking, increase all allies' crit rate for three turns. So this buffs everybody, plus it puts uh, the passive skills of the enemies on cooldown. That's why I tried to hit that Dell Lord with it, but it, it failed, even though it's 100%. Um, so, that's why I use him. Not only that, 35% attack speed, so that's pretty huge. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. Windwalker, you know why I'm using her. She makes everybody go faster and does more turns. She's on speed, defense, hit points. And she's at 264 speed. When you add that with the 35% speed lead, she goes very fast. And then the succubus, you can see her, she's at 193. Um, she, you know, after the speed buff from the Windwalker, she goes plenty fast. And I just got her, so I'm still ruining her up. She's on speed, hit points, defense. She got some hit. She's not sanctified yet, and I'm building a second one. Um, and basically, what we're doing with her is we're doing for this skill. So you're going to break the defense on your enemies, and you give your own guys attack buff for three turns, and it works out real nice. This one has a 30% chance to dispel enemies' buffs and affect them with hit point regen lock. So that's very nice, also. And then Lich. Lich King, you know, just nuke. Nuke, nuke, nuke. Alright, my other team. Golem. He is on immunity. And he's on hit points. Hit points. Hit points. I need a 6 star here. I need a 6 star there. Um, and his skill, he's just here. So whenever he gets attacked, he makes a shield for everybody. That's why he's in that team. And there's his stats. He's at about 60,000. He's, well, 59,664 life. So a lot. Goes very slow. He's using my uh, layer team, of course. Druid. He's at about 55,000 hit points. He's fast. And I use him with the heal and then the, uh, the counter. Dragoon, I have on. Oh, I gotta show you my runes. Speed, hit points, hit points for him. The Dragoon, I have Desolation on, or Desperation on, because he's. Uh, I use him for Vapor Dreamland. And he's on defense. Is that hit points? Hit point, defense, defense. Yeah, so I need an, a Desperation that's a defense there. I don't have one. Uh, the skills, um, passive guardian heart, so when his own hit points exceed 50%, grant 10% to the alley with the lowest percent hit point when attacked, and if he's less than 50%, he, 
he recovers 10%, except I have it all the way skilled up, so it's actually 10, 30%. So it's a nice heal when he gets hit. And then that's his regular attack, and then this one he duels. So you can take the healer out of their defense. And then Arthur. Arthur is on hit point or speed, hit points, hit points. And I should probably change that. I'm surprised that's not hit points. But you can see he's got a lot of hit points. He's at about 70,000. He's a little bit fast. Um, but why he's there is this. Uh, when an ally is attacked by a lawful chaotic or evil enemy, 70% chance to reduce their damage taken by 30%. And once I get it skilled up, it'll be 100% chance to um, stop them from taking damage. Or decrease the damage by 30%. And then this one... Um, has a chance to silence. And then he's got 25% uh, hit point lead. So... We'll run through a few more arena uh, ones here. I just wanted to show you guys where I actually am in arena. And we'll try this. I'm sure we'll be fast enough, but I don't know if we'll be able to kill him. And defense break. That's nice couple silences, a little bit of damage, and now we just go. There you go. So this team works very well if I'm fast enough, but certain things can beat it. I have a hard time with the Shura. If you know, uh, if you have ideas for a team I could be running that's going to help me with the Shura teams, or Asura, however you say his name, uh, I'd love comments, team comps, um, different skills I could be using, that kind of thing. But we'll see if I can beat it. But I'm sure Spider Queen's going to go. And then it's going to be trouble for me. So we will see. Well, we, we got to go first after that. There's the defense break. Mm, no damage reflection is not good. But I think I still got this on lockdown. We'll see. Maybe not. There you go. Asura. Yeah, I have a hard time with him for sure. Anyway, he reflects damage. Um, I will try my other team in there. Probably will not win either, but... I'm basically just trying out a bunch of different teams, and these are the ones I've had most success with. So that is why I'm running them. <coughs> and yeah, I doubt this one's going to work. Well, there you go. Arthur died very quickly. Yeah, that Ashura hits hard. The Destruction Idol, too. Druid dead, that ain't good. Well, their druid's dead too. Well, I guess I'm going to go for the destruction idol first. Wow, almost one hit the golem. Well, there you go. So, this is a showcase on how shitty I am against Sashura. <laughs> Um, those are the teams I've been running. We'll do one more here. I don't know if we'll win this one either, uh, just because it has Odin in it. 
but by far my best team is definitely this one with the Lich King and Succubus, Mikhail, and Windwalker. <laughs> That's a three person stun. Alright, guys, well, that is going to be the end of this one. Sorry about that, guys. Somebody walked into the man cave and uh, I had to cut that video short. But this is going to be the end of it, anyways. This is my fail suck at arena video so i appreciate you guys coming by we will catch you in the next video